we've been in business for 25 years? Um, we were in Woodstock for 15 years in two different locations there, and this would have been our 10th summer here at this location. There were probably 75 to 100 firemen um, out in full gear. Um, I don't know how many fire chiefs we saw from all the different departments. Uh, the police departments, the detectives were right on scene because it, it looked pretty much right away that this had been uh, an intentionally set fire. Professional firemen were here and just had to let them do their job and, and just hope and pray that when it was finished that we would have something sal salvageable. But then you look at this and it's, as you can see, it's, it's all gone. The whole kitchen and all tile floors I mean, was could, white and spotless. You could eat off this floor. And look at this. Everything is everything's ruined. Yep. These are these are white china plates. Yeah. If you can imagine. All of our china was white. <laughs> the detectives on the job did a great job. They were able to get information and then. Uh, put all the uh, facts together and were able to apprehend all three suspects and uh, get signed confessions within 28 hours. It's quite possible that they might get off on probation, on, on probation uh, because of their age and they have no serious priors and because of the crowding in the system and it's I mean that just blows me away when you look at what they've done to our life and what they've taken away from us. And our employees' lives and, and the customers that have been following us for 25 years now. You know, we love this location, you know, and right the, um, the reason we left Woodstock to come here was because of the river walk, and this was the prime location, and yeah, it still will, whatever happens to the property, it's going to be a cornerstone of the river walk, so. Our heart and soul is, was in our, our work. You know, and it's really the most devastating thing that's ever happened to me, I mean, us.